The Lisbon Village Cemetery has been around since 1834. A lot of history sitting on the property, even cannons from the Civil War. The problem is during this time of year, it's hard to keep up with the maintenance. We have 50 acres in this cemetery. And by the time you are in one area and you finish that, you just start over again. The cemetery has one full-time worker and one part-time worker, making it difficult to keep the grass cut. If we mow on Monday, by Wednesday it looks like we haven't done anything. It's also a time-consuming process. When you're mowing grass in the cemetery, it's not like it's in your backyard. I said you have so many obstacles that are in front of you, and you have to be very careful. James says a big reason they can't afford to hire more employees, money is not coming in like it used to because of less traditional burials. More people are opting for cremations. That has caused us uh, financial pain. Last year, there were a record high 26 cremations and a record low 29 burials, a trend happening throughout the country. In 2017, the U.S. cremation rate was over 51 percent, according to the Cremation Association of North America. By 2020, it's expected to be over 57 percent. In Lisbon, Brittany Bissell, WKBN 27 First News.